Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk to you about using formulas to work out the different sizes on your size spec. To start off with, we need to have the points of measurement listed. So our first column here, we've got the points of measurement, places that we're measuring on the garment. We've got the reference points for where those places sit on the garment. And we've also got the grade increments, so the amount that each of these points of measurement are graded. The next thing that we've got on this sheet is the size 10 in this case, because this is our sample size, size 10 measurements. So these are just an, a straight measurement for a size 10. Each of these is a straight measurement. And if we look up here in the formula bar, you may not be able to see that. Um, if you look in the formula bar, you'll see that it's a straight number. So we need to use the size 10 measurements to work out what our measurements for the size 8, 12, 14 and 16. And we use these measurements in conjunction with the grade increment. So from size 10, we're moving up one size to size 12. To create the um, formula, we're going to put equals and then we're going to click on this cell here with the amount in it and we want to add the amount of the grade. So my add or plus sign and then the grade amount and enter. That gives us the amount from the original plus the grade amount. Now the beauty of doing this is that it saves you time and effort because now once I've got this in here I can go to the bottom right corner, the lower right corner of my cell, get that little black plus sign, hover over it and then press my left mouse button and drag down and it's automatically going to calculate each of those other measurements for me. To get the size 14 I would do a similar process, it's equals this time it's equaling the size 12 amount plus the grade increment and enter. And again, clicking in the cell, going to the lower right corner, dragging down with my left mouse button held down and it's automatically calculating those amounts. To go to a smaller size, Instead of adding the grade increment, we would subtract it. So it still equals the size 10 value, this time minus or subtracting the grade amount and enter. And again, our dragging down to get all of those other values inserted. And our final one, on this sheet we've got a size 16, so equals size 16 is equal to the size 14 plus the grade amount and enter. And we go back, drag down from the bottom right corner through and we have all of our sizes calculated, all the different measurements for each size now inserted into our size spec. Remember to use these formulas, they're a much quicker and more efficient way of working. Thank you.